just a test if any if everyone's watching. Uh, just a quick thing. Um, how about uh, Patrick? Uh, in- you introduce yourself. Just tell us a little bit about yourself. All right. Well, hello, everyone. Uh, My name is Patrick Cotto. I am a sports reporter at uh, Naperville Community Television 17, and I'm happy to be a part of the uh, show, you know, DuPage, uh, you know, run and shoot show. So obviously with this, with this covering, you know, talking about schools in the DuPage County, a couple of the schools in the DuPage County we we cover at NCTV 17 is Naperville Central, Naperville North, uh, Wabonzi Valley, Matia Valley, and Bennett Academy. Obviously, for an equal hour school, they're in Will County, so uh, <laughs> you'll be seeing us at a lot of those uh, five area schools. And then, of course, for those non-conference matchups, you will see us reporters at NCTV 17 out there. You'll most likely see at all the Naperville Central games, just because I went there, I know the coaches, I know their new head coach, so you'll be seeing me covering all their games. And I got to say, NCTV does uh, one hell of a job covering those kids and prep sports. Well, this week we actually have our annual football previews coming out, airing on Sunday. So you'll definitely have to check that out. Awesome. All right. So since you introduced yourself, I'll introduce myself. Uh, just a really quick thing. Uh, my name is Coach Big Pete, a.k.a. Peter Lineover. Um I am publisher of deepdishfootball.com. Um, this is now my sixth year yeah that's crazy six year um as publisher of deep dish football um i cover most of the state of illinois 1a through 8a um but originally uh i'm from westmont i coached at westmont high school um i also uh scouted the dupage area when i was uh as part of a scouting system that we did for the deep dish football.com i know most of the coaches in the dupage area i coached against a lot of them too um, lost to a lot of them too, <laughs> but it is what it is. But um, it's it's something that I, I came to a point of. Well, there's not that much going on with DuPage County. There's no real. Uh, there is good coverage of DuPage County, but uh, there's not a weekly uh, webcast of covering of DuPage County, and uh, this gives us a shot to cover DuPage County. Uh, Patrick Cotto's knowledge of Naperville and uh, him going to Naperville Central and him covering all those Naperville schools, all those big schools. I think also Wabonzi Valley is part of that. And the whole – and Meta Valley, right? You guys cover Meta Valley? Matia Valley, yeah. Matia Valley, uh, you know. uh, Matia Valley, I'm sorry. Yeah. It's all good. Uh, All those Those schools are supposed to be really, really good this year. Obviously, Pete, uh, you know, we expect Matia Valley to step up in the spring. Slopes, they were slow but steady, but this year – Look out for those Mustangs. Yeah. That's going to be that, – You bring it back NIU recruit Jalen Johnson. I mean, all those guys yeah. who are seniors right now, they're basically playing since they were sophomores on varsity. So Yeah. I really well, think Bonzi that – um, Yeah, I really think that DuPage Valley Conference is going to be just an absolute – it's going to be an absolute titan in the state of Illinois. Yeah, like it, it's going to – as John Drendel calls it, it's comp- the conference is going to be a bear. It is going to be a bear. I mean, every one of that conference is literally bringing back experienced talent. Central's bringing back talented players. North's bringing back talented players. Matias bringing back yep. talented players. Well, Bonzi, they're bringing back Jesus Christ like everybody. Yes, yes. Nathan Pappas is. I love that. I love that kid at quarterback. Oh yeah, definitely got a good beard yeah. going. <laughs> Chance to talk yeah. to him in person. Still has to catch up with your beard, but got yeah, Pappas. Yep. Uh, it's pronounced as Pappas. Uh, it's all good. Uh, Tyler Helping is back at wide receiver. You got Jabron Lee and Antonio Torres is back at Wabonzi. Yep. And we'll go into all this uh, starting uh, next week. Every Thursday, 8 p.m., we're going to be talking to Page Football. We're also going to be talking small schools, Lyle. Uh, we're going to be talking about West Chicago, Westmont, IC is a tight end of a team this year. Wheaton, St. Francis. Oh, my God. We in St. Francis. Oh yeah, I actually, well, uh, I'm that? actually friends with um, I'm actually friends with uh, TJ's older brother Bobby. We both we we both played at Central. Okay, okay, yeah, that TJ. That's, old, that's, TJ, oh that, my God, that kid is! I remember seeing that yeah. guy on the sidelines while we were playing. He was just a little monster running around, and yeah. oh, Jesus Christ, I do not want to mess with him. <laughs> and he plays three sports too. No, I'm sorry, he plays I mean, baseball and football. The kids he didn't beast. play basketball. He, he, he didn't play basketball last season. I know he played basketball his freshman season. Okay, then I might then I must be wrong. You're probably right. 
but the kid's a beast. Well, I mean, it was a weird couple sports seasons, so um, it's yeah. – hopefully the season is a somewhat normal. It's not It's not officially yes. normal because we're still wearing the big, you know – Oh, yeah. Stuff. Which, by the way, when it gets cold out, um, I think those I think they're going to be some clutch scarves. <laughs> oh yes, oh yes. <laughs> I went to I was down in uh, Quincy for their uh, the first game of the spring season, and uh, yeah, a lot of people didn't have masks on. I was the only one that was wearing a mask. <laughs> yeah, but no, I mean we talk about DuPage County Schools. Cent- Dapeful Central's yep. got a tough Week One opponent. You know, yes, a sweet place yes. in Mulvanti face off. Uh, Matia yep. faces Geneva. That's a governor good school. I mean, yes. North also plays Bennett Academy Week One. Mm-hmm. I mean, Bennett Academy they lost a lot from last year, but they're bringing back some good players. And uh, Wheaton Warrenville South has now got a new head coach in Sean Norris. Ron Muhich has retired. Yep. It's yep. gonna. Uh, Sean Norris is a. He's a hell of a coach, and uh, just he's a. Uh, he's gonna bring a new energy to Weedon Warrenville stuff that I'm. Uh, that I'm excited uh, to see, and uh, I think a lot of people are. I hate to say, it, people are sleeping on Naperville North. I like Naperville North. I'm not sleeping on the Huskies either. They're bringing back a lot. You got uh, Eight and Gray yep. who played quarterbacks yep. a sophomore. You got you know Zeke Williams, Ethan Robert coming back. They just a lot. They just lost a lot of size up front. So hopefully, you know. Whoever, whoever you know takes control up front helps out the Huskies. Yep. Yeah, no, I and you can't, I, yeah, and you can't forget about Kevin there. Madden. Kevin Madden at defensive tackle. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. Exactly, and you know Central, they're bringing back you know some some size up front. You know wide receivers are back. They uh, bring bring in uh, James Jobes, who missed off last year because of a back back issues. Yeah, Luke Boyd, tight end. Like you're going to be seeing this is a, this is going to be a good year for high school football. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Well, I think that about wraps it up for the test. Oh my God, and, you uh, got me excited for the show next week. Yep. You know, we, the show <laughs> next week, 8 p.m. every Thursday. We're talking two page football. We are talking two page football, and um, this is G rated. I, I think this will be G rated, obviously. So yes, yes, very G rated. <laughs> I, I'll be a good boy. Like I said, I, like, are you a Cubs or a Sox fan? I am a White Sox fan. You're a White Sox fan? Okay, so basically, you're Steve Stone. I'm Hawk Harrison. Oh, no. <laughs> no. Oh, you do sound like Hawk Harrison. <laughs> oh, no. Electric. The, the pen. So, yep. <laughs> Just, um, um, make well, sure you well, follow... Some- what do you say? Oh. Yeah, so if someone, if the ref makes a questionable call, uh, don't go Hawk Harrelson mode. No, I won't. I won't. I promise. I promise. <laughs> um, just a quick reminder for everyone: follow Patrick Cotto, uh, uh, Mojo's. What is it? Mojo's code on Twitter. Cotto's Mojo. Cotto's Mojo. Follow that on Twitter. Also follow DuPage Run Shoot Show on Twitter and uh facebook and every thursday 8 p.m we're going to be talking dupage county football and um thank you to my uh co-host patrick Cotto, that's going to be part of the show i'm really excited um he's a wordsmith unlike me i'm a caveman he's a wordsmith it should be a lot of fun <laughs> yeah no i'm definitely excited <laughs> for the show pete i mean after what we're talking about tonight uh next week <laughs> is going to be electric yep oh yeah all right have a good one sir You too, Coach Big Pete, and we'll be talking next week. Yep.